The Democratic Republic of Congo and other parts of Africa are experiencing an increase in MPOX clade 1 cases. For background, in 2022, there was a global outbreak related to clade 2. There are two kinds of MPOX. Because of the increased number of cases in Africa, the World Health Organization has declared a public health emergency of international concern. So what does that mean for us in the United States? The risk for clade 1 in the United States remains low though there are other parts of the world that are seeing new clade one cases. So what that means is that we really need to keep up the work to make sure that we keep ourselves safe. The best line of defense against MPOX is vaccination if you're someone who needs it. So who needs an MPOX vaccination? If you're a gay, bisexual, or other same gender loving, or a man who has sex with men, or a transgender individual, someone who's non-binary or gender diverse, who may have some sexual risk exposures that puts them at risk, you should definitely make sure that you're up to date with the Geneos vaccine for MPOX. That vaccine is two doses. If you've only gotten one dose, get that second dose. It's never too late. If you've gotten both doses, you're good to go. We are getting a lot of questions about whether or not boosters are necessary. At this time, there is no recommendation for an additional dose or booster if you've gotten your two doses of vaccine. And what if you've had MPOX before? Well, you don't need to be vaccinated. So big message is, clade one is out there. We're seeing it in Africa. The risk in the US is likely low, but if you are someone who needs an MPOX vaccine, this is the time to make sure that you're up to date because that is a great defense for preventing MPOX in the U.S. as well as preventing MPOX in your life.